South Carolina experienced 10 earthquakes in the last two weeks, and this isn't the first time this state's experienced a group of earthquakes scientists call swarms. Our Caroline Yaffa tells us how people can prepare for the tremors. I'm here at the Emergency Operations Center in West Columbia, and one of the things they do is track and prepare for earthquakes. They even have this app that shows where earthquakes are happening around the state of South Carolina. Over the past few weeks, South Carolina has experienced several earthquakes, ranking above a two on the magnitude scale. Experts say those are minor quakes, some you may not even feel. Earthquakes don't announce themselves and you're never ready for them. The U.S. Geological Survey reports Greenwood County has had 10 earthquakes in the past week. Spokesperson Abby Banks says it can be unsettling. I have heard people say that when they felt it, they went outside to look for a tree fall. Like they thought it was another tree that had fallen because it had that kind of little bit of rumble that they had felt, you know, two weeks before. South Carolina Department of Natural Resources state geologist Scott Howard says the state is on a fault line, so the earthquakes will continue. And, and given the state of the, of the, of the stress field, um, Certain structures will be more prone to reactivate than other structures. It just so happens this week is ShakeOut Earthquake Preparedness Week, and drills were held across the country in schools and businesses. South Carolina Emergency Management Division Director Kim Stenson says you should always be prepared. You know, some people can com become complacent in terms of uh, not thinking it's a threat, but it is a real threat here in South Carolina, and we need to prepare for that just like we prepare for hurricanes. Director Stenson says the earthquakes happening now should not be a big concern, but urges people to look at the South Carolina Earthquake Guide to make sure you know what to do. We've seen just about everything that you could have happen, I think, uh, here in South Carolina. Uh, and the key message there is know your threats and then be prepared, and we've got the tools to help you get prepared. If you experience an earthquake, one thing to remember is to cover your head and neck or get under a sturdy shelter in case something falls on you. In Columbia, Caroline Yaffa, 7 News. We do have a link to South Carolina's earthquake guide that includes all the good safety information as well as what you need to have in your supply kit. All of that is posted with this story at WSPA.com.